Yo, what is up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's getting good guys. We're gonna start doing this exam for the Royal Knight to see who gets to join this elite squad. First up, we got Asta's group going up against some other random group. They're in pairs of threes. Asta's with Mimosa and the mystery guy that we have no idea, no idea what this guy does or who he really is because he's impersonating vice captain of the purple orcas. He ended up like, you know, defeating him, took his cape, wearing it. Now he's saying that he's that guy, but he's not. So we don't even know his name. We know he's a menace though. And we know he looks like a badass. So I'm excited to see, you know, what this episode brings. Hopefully we can see some more insight on um, who, he, who this person really is, honestly. Let's just get started. I don't know why I'm doing a lot of this with my hands. I'm just very excited. So don't judge me, but sit back, relax. Now let's go ahead and get started on this reaction video. Y'all, I am getting so excited for this. You guys have no idea. And Asta's going up first, dude. So we're going to see him go crazy. I don't even know who the other people are, but it doesn't matter because we're Team Asta, right? Yeah, dude. He's excited to fucking kick some ass. That's what he's excited for. <laughs> this guy's a fucking smart ass. <laughs> Mosa, get your head in the game. Yes, what kind of magic do you use? Please enlighten us. And now they're fucking up the crystal already. We barely just started. Come on, guys. You guys gotta get your head in the game. They literally just started. We got a fucking sniper on the other team. What the hell? Oh, fuck. Bow and arrow? That's actually pretty cool. Fire arrow as well. Add it. And if they're not careful, they're going to end up destroying their crystal. They got to do something about that, man. I have a feeling that this guy is going to end up costing on the match, dude. He just doesn't care. He really does not care one bit. I'm telling you, he does not care. Bro, can we just beat that guy's ass real quick? Jesus. Or is this... Maybe this is part of the strategy. Or maybe he really just doesn't care. They're gonna end up shooting at him and he's not gonna like that and then that's when he's gonna end up like picking things up. Shoot Zerks, please. Shoot him. Go. Nice. That's a good start. But that's only one hit though. His reflexes are pretty good. But like I said, that's only one one arrow. They still got multiple other ones. Man, that guy is pissing me off, bro. Like he literally is useless right now. Right now it's two on three. But Mimosa, she's a good strategist, it looks like. <laughs> yes, he is. Nah, bro. That guy's literally just sleeping right now. He don't care. And if honestly, if they can win with just them two, that's all that matters because then they'll be able to go on to the next round. Bro, just bring out the demon. It's game over, man. Austin, bring out that demon, man. That's all you guys need. Ooh. Mid range attack? <laughs> if it wasn't for them blocking it, that would have been it. 
And she kept her word, Mimosa, she got stronger. This is impressive, from both ends. Such a good teammate right now. Magic Cannon Flower. That's insane and strong. That's the thing too, it's a strong attack. And you know what, maybe if she blasts into the rock, that'll like create a divergence or a distraction and then Asa can kind of just like swoop in, cut the fucking thing up. And they, and the whole team can see this from Mimosa's side, from Asa's side. Mimosa's amazing. But not because of you, Sylph. Damn, they're trying to split him up. Has to go. Yeah. That's that's the only reason they did it to split them up because they know both of them together are too good. Oh, he just fell into a trap. What is that? What is that? Charmy, why are you cheering, Charmy? That's your boy. A paralysis trap, dude. And right now he's not even there, so he can't even slice it to get rid of the magic. Oh boy, this is not good. Now it's Mimosa versus three of them. That other guy better step in, I'm telling you, bro. He better step in right now. He's gonna step in. Come on, he better step in right now, dude. Come on, step in, step in, step in, step in, step in. There he goes. So it's like a dimension portal, kinda. Like, it just sucks away the, the magic and probably like redirects it or just sends it away. Now it's gonna get redirected. Like, I, dude, like I was saying, it like redirects it back. Don't end, please don't end. Okay, thank God. He knocked out all three of them too. Bro, fuck Asta, go get the crystal. A singer magic knight? Strong guy. Literally just walk towards it. The disrespect, yo. Even losing. Ash magic. That was his? Are you fucking serious right now? Is he here for Asta? He just said he wasn't there for it to win, but yet he still destroyed the crystal. <laughs> I'm I'm still confused with this guy. I don't know what his deal is. Is he? So he's just talking shit. <laughs> it's like a part of me likes him, but a part of me doesn't like him. It's kind of a shitty plan, but I guess it worked. Oh. So in other words, Asta is the one that triggered those circles that redirected the hit. 
and it amplifies that attack that goes through them. Magna? This next match is going to be interesting. They have no type of teamwork. If we're being honest, probably no one's going to have a good teamwork this whole, this whole exam. <laughs> oh jeez. It looks like they're not very fond of each other, and I can see why. <laughs> Dude, not gonna lie guys, this episode kind of had me a little scared. I, for a second, I thought that they would have lost. This guy is literally something else. A part of me, like I said, doesn't know if I like him or if I hate him. It's a 50-50 relationship right now. You don't know if he really wants to help out, if he's just lazy, if he just doesn't care about anything other than himself, or if he, if it's just like an act, you know what I'm saying? So like, like I said, like right here, he actually helped the team to win. Each time that I see him in each episode, I still get more questions as to who the this guy is why is he here what's his end goal is he an actual magic knight or is he somebody from the outside from a different kingdom pretending to be and he's just taking advantage of this whole situation that's been presented to him on the bright side though the team passed they're going to the next round thankfully but we're gonna leave off the episode here guys if you guys like the video go ahead and give it a like leave a comment subscribe to the channel it really does help and i'll see you guys in for the next reaction video peace